All right. What are we doing, Roxy? Well, today we are going to make a, a silk screen shower curtain. We're going to silk screen on a shower curtain. So, in terms of the elements, this is a silk screen, and it already has um, an image on it, like an oval. Not really an oval, but sort of like a racetrack design that I've that I drew and exposed onto the silk screen. This is ink, nice orange co color today. Thinking about orange and January 6th hearings, but anyway, won't go there. Um, let's see what else I've got going on. Um, these are squeegees. Now, squeegees should, and you can see that I've taped around here, so that, so that basically I've covered the areas that I don't want ink to go through. I do see some spots, but we'll see. This is a speedball squeegee, and what I'm gonna be doing is pouring ink in and dragging it down. Um, this one would be the proper size. This one would be too small because it wouldn't cover the whole um, space. All right, so what I'm gonna do is, since it's the first time I've used this in a while, and there we go, it's beautiful. Put a little ink down there, water-based speedball, and sort of give it the old, the old spatula. <laughs> and then I'm going to, um, I'm going to lift it up just slightly, and I'm going to drag the ink through the exposed space to um, basically to fill in the fibers, so that when I'm going to land it down and I'm just going to, with some pressure, pull it towards me and I'm going to lift up. Okay, so now that we've, we've done a, um, our designs on this, it's time to clean up. And actually, it's not terribly bad to clean up silk screen, this kind of silk screen, because it's a water-based um, material. So I'm just going to scrape the ink back into since I have I didn't put anything into this ink like I didn't put any kind of extender um, and I can just reuse it again um, you can just basically use simple simple tools um, and I often will have pieces of uh, uh, cardboard to help me just clean my just clean off the screen because um, you don't want to you don't want the, the sink the studio sink to get like really backed up with ink. It's it's very very wasteful, and I can just use this again. Uh, and there you go. And that's fantastic. Oopsies. So we have a that's our first um, image on this uh, shower curtain. Okay, right. we're, we're good. good. And then um, and then what I'm going to do is it's good to have a uh, uh, a place. I'm going to unscrew it from the hinges and release the screen. Nice thing about having hinges is that uh, it, it holds the it holds the screen in place. But you can, if you really wanted to, you could just land your screen down, boop, 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 boop like that. But that's that's not how we're gonna do um, this particular project. And I'm gonna lift the screen and I'm gonna hold the plastic down. All right, so it's coming out fun. So now we have two. So so we're making a design, a random um, pattern. Uh, on this and we're just going to keep going until um, we have a full uh, design on our shower curtain. Now we're going to let this dry a little bit before we do another uh, pull. So we're just going to set this. Run, yeah. Run that that way. We're going to let that go there. So you can see, you can see through this. And so you know, it's been cleaned thoroughly. All good, on to the next one.